Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, give the example for method overloading implementation in a Selenium web driver library. Let me answer. In Selenium web driver library, we have a lot of predefined uh, classes, interfaces, and they have predefined methods. I'm going to give you an example of one such kind of predefined methods which belong to the predefined classes and interfaces of Selenium web driver library, okay, where this method overloading, overloading concept is implemented or Java is implemented and all. So the example is nothing but frame related example case, okay. So most of the people may have already worked with frames, okay. So if on a particular page, there is a frame and on that frame or inside that frame, if there is an element, then in order to perform operation on that element inside the frame, First, we have to switch from the page to the frame. Okay, driver dot switch to frame command we have to use. Okay, then after switching to the frame, then only we can perform the operation on the element. Otherwise, we'll get no such element exception. Right, that is the thing. But there are several ways for switching to the frame. Not always the frame will have the ID. Okay, in some cases, the frame will have the ID, guys. Okay, with the help of the ID of the frame, we'll switch to the frame. Okay, in some cases, ID won't be there, but name locator will be there. So driver dot switch to dot frame of the same frame command, but in place of ID, you are passing name. This is overloaded method. Okay. Your frame, you are passing the ID locator. Your frame, you are passing name locator. Either of the things you are passing. But the method name is same. There's no separate method like frame, uh, frame ID kind of method or frame name. Okay. So we don't have to, pre, uh, the predefined uh, methods don't have to be a list of 10 or like that for each and every category, right? Rather the same command frame is being used, but uh, the whatever the value you are passing to that frame command or method is changing, okay? Dynamically, internally, it will take care. That is called as method overloading. Frame with ID means that particular predefined method, implemented, overloaded method in that class of that frame, okay, you know, uh, will be called accordingly, frame of name. Then if ID is not there for the frame for switching or locating the frame and switching and name is name locator is not there for uh, locating the frame and switching, we can also use frame of web element, okay? This is the final option that uh, we have. We can also pass the web element. If you are passing the web element, this overloaded method of the frame web element, okay? So internally in Selenium web driver library, for each and every implementation, frame ID, frame name, frame web element, there is separate method there, okay? In a class and, uh, but uh, when you are calling it, you know, you can simply pass ID, name, web element. You don't have to write frame ID, of ID, frame name of name, like that you don't have to write. Simply frame of ID, automatically overloaded method of frame ID will be called. The same method, uh, I mean methods having the predefined methods having the same name in Selenium web driver library, simple words, okay? And one more variation is also there, overloaded variation for frame, that is frame of index. Let me show you practically this uh, overloaded methods uh, of this, um, okay, frame, uh, overloaded frame methods in the Selenium web driver library. So for that, I'll switch to this Eclipse ID, remove all this stuff. It's not required. Simply just uh, write down the code here. I'm not going to run this, but I'm going to simply show you. Okay, driver dot switch to, I'll say frame. You see, a lot of overloaded methods are coming. When I say switch to, frame means you can either provide index or you can provide either name or ID or you can provide web element of the frame. Okay, three, three overloaded methods are coming. Okay, three, either you can pass index or you can pass the, uh, in double quotes, you can pass the ID, ID locator value or name locator value. Okay, whatever the web elements name locator, uh, frames uh, name locator value, or you can pass the web element, okay? Whatever the driver dot find element kind of thing you can pass here, okay? So like that, so this is one of the example, okay? Of, uh, uh, you know, method overloading implementation in Selenium web drivers library, okay? So, hope oh guys, you got the answer for this question. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.